for under 40 seconds. So there is a delay. So get ready, guys. We're about T minus 30 seconds or so. T minus 30 seconds. Okay. Three seconds. Stay at the rocket for now. T-minus 40 seconds in bowling. We've had a rapid recycle. We've not heard anything over the countdown then as the team marks about 13 second stages. We're gonna monitor the nets there for a minute. <laughs> so they can stay in this T-minus 40 second bowl throughout the, I mean they have, they have uh, 20 full minutes of launch window. Yes. There are a lot of boats. Got a little bit of an update. We're continuing to hold T minus 40 seconds. This is the normal hold point for Starship, as we talked earlier. Sounds like we're working just late pressurization on, I believe, the second stage. Team is working it. All the other systems are on hold right now, 40 seconds. We can hold here for about 15 minutes or so uh, before we would run out of window for this morning. Mary, this is worried about boat traffic but they're in the so channel, Right now they're is... working on filling pressure vessels. And ideally we'll be able to salt this and come back and release the clock at T-minus 40 seconds. We're going to continue to listen and monitor for another few months. So there you go. So they're just trying to top off, make sure the vehicle and make sure the upper stage is fully prepped and fully conditioned at the right pressures, temperatures, everything, and fully fueled so that with propellant. Of course it's using Methalox fuel. Wearing my Methalox shirt. And it's, it's worth mentioning here that don't go away. We are holding at T minus 40 seconds, but once the teams have, have resolved and, and see the data that they want to see, the clock can restart straight away.